What makes a thunderstorm severe as opposed to a quote unquote regular thunderstorm? And there are some criteria that a storm has to meet before the National Weather Service issues a severe thunderstorm warning for your area. And these are the two things, not both at the same time, but just one of these two things. The storm has to have either wind gusts at 58 miles per hour or greater or hail one inch in diameter. Now, sometimes you can have a storm that's not very windy, but it's got big hail in it. So it doesn't have to be both of these, just one of the two. And any severe thunderstorm can produce a tornado, even without a tornado warning. So obviously you got to keep that in mind. But most likely, if you're under a severe thunderstorm warning, you're going to get some heavy rain and lightning as well. But again, those two things are not in the criteria for the severe thunderstorm warning to be issued. Wind gusts 58 miles per hour or greater, or hail one inch in diameter. The only severe thunderstorm watch that's in effect near us right now is up in north central Pennsylvania and into the southern part of New York State. There's no severe thunderstorm watch in effect for the Baltimore Metro as of yet. But as Tom mentioned, the further we go into the evening, the better the chance that maybe some of those big storms will catch up to us.